How's it going guys? Uh, so today's video pretty much we're going to be talking about uh, what Rugby 18 could possibly look like. Obviously you guys wanted to see more Rugby videos so basically I'm going to give you that. Uh, so yeah, I designed some arty covers that Rugby 18 could potentially look like or from my point of view anyway that would look pretty cool. I want to see what you guys opinion, what your guys opinions are and uh, yeah. So yeah, uh, so obviously number one is well, I kind of wanted to have a look, uh, like a FIFA look to it, you know, where you have the players on the front cover and then obviously the licenses, the leagues. Uh, obviously, as you can see as well, it's got the uh, official sponsor, the Eco and Big Ben Interactive. Um, but yeah, I thought it, quite, it would look quite cool if you had like the background on the backdrop or whatever and then the players on it. Pick Mario is Hoja because obviously he's like the upcoming star, lady with the Lions and everything, so. And obviously the game already being licensed to the Aviva Premiership, I thought obviously he should be one of the main ones in line for the front cover. Um, obviously then I got Stuart Hogg and Reese Webb, I felt they were kind of good talents in Britain and uh, yeah, that's why. Number two, we have, well I was kind of inspired by, do you remember the Rugby 18 thing I originally came up with, the game, the unofficial game video, if you haven't seen that then go check that out. Um, but yeah, basically the cover of that was a picture of me uh, in a tunnel, of the like, stadium tunnel, and uh, I thought it'd be quite cool to have a tunnel picture and then rugby team. I just I don't know. I thought it's a good effect to it. Uh, you guys might think differently, but I don't know. I think it looks good. And number three, then we have again it's kind of like the FIFA covers. I picked Farrell this time. Uh, Farrell is probably one of the best uh, tens that is currently in the Northern Hemisphere. And uh, if you're from, if you're watching from the Southern Hemisphere or any other side of the world, uh, it's basically the Northern Hemisphere I picked is because, uh, well, the game so far is just licensed for Northern Hemisphere stuff um, as of today anyway, which is currently the 7th of July. Uh, the game might change again, but uh, as of this exact date, um, yeah, those are the only teams announced in Northern Hemisphere. So. Yeah, that's why I picked these players, and yeah, Liam Williams obviously in that cover as well because uh, he's a very good talent. He's uh, doing really well for the Lions as well. So uh, yeah. Uh, so this other cover then, uh, cover number four. Uh, personally, I felt this was probably the best one I made. Uh, as you can see, it's got the rugby ball background, the rugby 18 logo, and then all the licenses that I think the game is going to have anyway. Um, but yeah, I was quite mostly proud of this one. The colours I thought went really well together and it just generally does look pretty good. And so yeah, that's cover number four. Um, then cover number five. And what kind of wanted to keep to like retro look. Some people might like it, some people might not. Um, so yeah, it's basically just a rugby field of uh, old fashioned rugby ball. I thought that would look quite cool. Uh, potentially moving the mode into it as well of having, say, like the older unprofessional generation of rugby like you know you have uh, JPR Williams and uh, what's called Gareth Edwards and everybody like that and uh, or even Jeremy Guscott or Joe Malonu uh, I think that would look quite cool uh, it's not probably not going to happen but potentially I don't know in future maybe um, but yeah this video is just a bit of fun really uh, so yeah uh, the next one then we have is a sunset version of it. Uh, obviously with the Rugby 18 logo being white, black and gold, I thought those colours would go really well with a sunset backdrop with a silhouette of a Rugby, uh, rugby post. Um, but yeah, there's not really much I can talk about this one, but I thought it looked quite cool. The colours went well and uh, yeah, I don't know, you guys might think different. Um, so yeah, my, this other one then, I was quite pleased with this one as well. I got a picture of Owen Farrell. Uh, playing for Saracens, and it was actually an interview picture as well, which was on the Saracens website. But I thought something like that would go really well on a sports game cover. So, for example, that's why I put it with uh, Rugby 18. Uh, I don't know if you guys have seen, but uh, FIFA 18, the new one coming up, has got like a black backdrop with uh, Cristiano Ronaldo. It's uh, kind of like similar to this picture, and it does look really good and it works really well. So that's why I picked this picture and. Uh, you guys, I'm hopefully you agree too, and uh, yeah, but it's not my favourite one. Um, so the final one then that I made was a picture of a stadium from a bird's eye view, uh, rugby 18 then going through the middle of it, and then some licensed leagues on it then. Um, but yeah, personally that's not my favourite one. 
Uh, my favourite one was literally probably the rugby ball one, as I said. Uh, the colours for I thought went really well. Um, but yeah, so yeah, that's pretty much the end of the video. Uh, so don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more rugby vids. Uh, there will be more on the way. Um, but yeah, if you want, if you want to comment and let me know any ideas that you want to see, then feel free to let me know. I'm up for any suggestions. Uh, comment, let me know what you thought of this video and also what art you personally thought was the best one. Um, but yeah, as for me, I'm sticking with the rugby ball idea. I thought that looked pretty good. Uh, but yeah, let me know what you guys thought. It would actually be really nice to hear from you. And uh, yeah, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, yeah, there'll be more rugby videos on the way. And uh, yeah, when Rugby 18 finally comes out, we'll be playing it. So if you're new and you haven't subscribed yet, then you should definitely subscribe. Right, thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.